I lived in this apartment, this is probably where I would spend all of my time. This is the 18th floor at 115 Central Park West, known as the Majestic. We're on the corner of 72nd Street, overlooking Central Park at the perfect height. To the north of me is the Dakota, every major Upper West Side landmark. This is what we call the Gold Coast of the Upper West Side on Central Park West. And then obviously south, we have the entire skyline. This is our newest Sirhant signature listing. It is an incredible five bedrooms, plus, 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 and plus. And it is all about the views from these multiple gorgeous terraces. I'm so excited to show you this. Let me take this in one more time. You can literally smell the leaves on top of the trees and the freshly cut grass. It is incredible to be here. Let's go. Now, the outdoor space is incredible, but what makes this home extra special starts with your entrance. Private elevator landing onto the 18th floor with incredible entry foyer space. You really are entering into your own private gallery. And then you have three living spaces, three. Right now, we're in what I call our formal living area, our receiving area. This could have a great TV or it could stay very formal the way it is now. If you play piano, obviously you could fit, I don't know, 20 pianos throughout this entire apartment or just the one is fine. And you are flanked by these gorgeous windows out over the park. Now what's extra important here, when you look at any pre-war co-op uptown is who did these renovations? Because these renovations are exquisite. This is an Annabelle Seldorf artistic masterpiece. This isn't just a combination apartment. It's not just a gut renovated 18th floor, amazing home. This is an Annabelle Seldorf home. So think about that as you're noticing the herringbone floors, as you're noticing the vents in the millwork, as you're noticing the lighting, the art lighting and all the detail, especially when we get to the kitchen, which is a lot of fun. So this is a big open living space. You have the decorative mantle. Now I wanna take you to the kitchen, dining, and second living room. Before we even get into this room, please notice these doors. These steel frame doors, how gorgeous they are, how they provide the privacy, but just that attention to detail. And you'll see them throughout the home. Now this is our dining and family space breakfast room, kind of family living space. You're 26 feet long with an extra long terrace also off this room accessible right here, looking due north over the Upper West Side and Central Park. I mean, I can still see all of the trees when I'm sitting and when I sit down having a formal dinner or my morning cup of coffee. I don't personally drink coffee, but maybe you do and I'm just trying to set the mood for you. Behind me, is the kitchen I was talking about. And here's what I love about this kitchen, okay? When you're working with a designer like Annabelle Seldorf, you're working with somebody that understands context, that understands place, that understands provenance. There's so many apartments that are renovated outside of context in beautiful buildings like the Majestic that don't make sense, right? You walk into those homes, you're expecting something very, very, very magnificent and you're hit with modern left and modern right and it doesn't fit. This is an Art Deco kitchen. This is stainless steel. Look at these countertops. Look at these cabinets. Also, look at the detail of all the glassware. This kitchen speaks to the time of this building and yet it is completely modern with all the modern amenities you'd need. We have our appliance hallway. We have our glass front commercial sub-zero graded refrigerator and storage on top of storage on top of storage. Behind me is a full laundry room. Actually, it's so big, I'll call it a suite. And then we have more and more and more and more and more that continues to go. Wine cooler, et cetera, et cetera. Now, I wanna take you to our bedroom wing, our sleeping wing. Bedroom number five, currently set up as a library and den is probably one of my favorite rooms in the home because of how warm it is, but it's also classic Seldorf with the textures, 
with the millwork and the level of detailing that you'll see on all of the cabinet faces with this incredible mantle, look at this. And look at the juxtaposition of the coloring with the stone, right? You've got the antique meeting the fire rated brick that's very, very, very clean. And then all the room for some pretty, pretty exquisite artwork. Now this could easily be a bedroom, it could be a guest room space, but I love the way it is right now, it depends on what you need. And then I'm hit on either side with these gorgeous double doors out over another terrace looking out over the park. Now, more bedrooms, follow me. Now you've got your second and third guest bedroom down this hallway. Incredible storage throughout. And before we get into our primary, you have to understand that closet space and shoes are in the DNA of this home. We have an incredible walkthrough closet here that is perfectly positioned for all types of clothing. And then look at this one. Look how deep this is. You have drawers and closets and cabinets galore. And then where it gets really fun, back here, our shoe closet. A secret little cubby back here for all of the different types of shoes you could have. And it's maybe my second favorite room in this entire apartment because it's just so cool. Where do you find something like that? It's awesome. No pun intended, but the primary suite is majestic in and of itself. It's a majestic size, the closets, the bathroom, which I'm about to show you. Your final bedroom is off this hallway right here, currently set up as an office. And then you have your own private terrace with the most stunning views of Central Park. And look at this bathroom, the level of detail, this tub, the stone matching bookmarked all the way through. You have a gorgeous window looking out over the park and then the shower. Not only has jets on jets on jets, but goes all the way through to an additional tub, toilet, and vanity space. And then we're back on one of my favorite spaces in all of New York City, actually. The experience here in the mornings is exquisite. And then in the afternoons, as the sun sets over the park and you're watching the shadows of the skyscrapers touch you, I mean, it's, it is a majestic experience. And I'm sorry for saying that word again, because I know we're in the majestic on the Upper West Side, but it really is something quite exquisite. This is our newest Serhant signature listing, a gorgeous five bedroom perched on the 18th floor at one of the Upper West Side's most fantastic pre-war co-ops, now available exclusively through Chase Landau at Serhant. Thank you so much for watching.